How's it going everybody? My name is Finpire and we are playing the Siege. I haven't played this game in uh, fucking ages. The, f the last time I played this game was probably the big, oh, very close to when I started the channel. I did a couple of episodes on it and, uh, you know, I went through the levels and things like that. And that was, yeah, it was pretty cool. But I think, I think I hit a bit of a wall in trying to make my own stuff. Because when it comes to this sort of shit, I'm not that creative. But I really enjoyed playing the game, so I thought... You know, I might as well go back and try and actually start playing this game again because it's a, you know it's it's heaps of fun and uh, there's loads of stuff out there now like you know uh, community created content. So I thought, why not grab a couple of the uh, creations and we'll take a look today. So I've grabbed a few and I think we'll load them up and uh, see if we can get them working. First one I grabbed here was uh, purely just because I've been playing Mad Max. And yeah, this is uh, it's really basic, this one, but this one's called the Magnum Opus, which, you know, if you haven't seen my videos on that, you should go, you should go watch those as well. But this looks freaking cool just for a car. Yeah, it's, yeah like I said, it's basic, but who cares? It's, a, it's an awesome car. Let's try and uh, see if we can get this one driving around. I reckon we could try and maybe smash into that windmill over there. Let's see if we can give that a go. All right. This one doesn't run too bad. Oh, man, this is cool. This is pretty awesome. It's even got flames and shit that shoot out the back. That's fucking cool. And it's got cannons and stuff, which I'm hoping are mapped to see. They should be mapped to see, but I reckon we could take this out. I know we're, we're just stalled here and we're really not... Oh no, oh Jesus Christ, that's bad. Okay, all right, it's fine, it's fine. Because now we're out in the open and we can just drive around like this car was fucking made to. Look at this! Chucking some doughies! Oh, okay, I think we broke the wheels. Oh shit. Okay. You could stop, maybe stop that. That'd be great. Oh fuck. I forgot how this game just likes to freak out just in random occasions. It's like, no, I can't calculate that. So I'm going to start doing thousands of backflips. Okay. All right. This is not how you drive your car. All right. Let's just, uh, let's just load this one up again and maybe not bother trying to go over that stupid spinning bridge and we'll head over this way. Oh, it was a fucking sheep. All right. Let's not hit the sheep. Where's Mad Max? We need Mad Max, man. That guy's fucking cool. Punches on with all the dudes. And Chum Bucket. We need Chum Bucket on the back there. Oh, man, look at this! Oh, drifting! <laughs> this is awesome! Oh, man, this is this is really freaking cool. I've honestly missed playing this game. I had so much fun with it last time. Man, and they've added new levels and things like that. So I might have to jump into those and finish those at some point I think there's some flying levels and stuff, but yeah, I mean, oh man, this is sweet. All right, surely we can shoot a few things Pop a cap in someone's ass with our cannon. Oh, all right. We're gonna probably no no We're doing really well man. I can't believe how how well this thing handles This is really fucking cool. All right. Can we line this guy up? I'm pretty sure that's it. Oh yeah, yeah, we fucking got it. All right, I, I'm pretty sure this is a floaty pad. Oh, we hit it at the wrong angle. Oh, do a fucking backflip, bro. No, we didn't do a backflip. Okay, maybe we'll just uh, reverse it. Oh, Jesus Christ, there's a bomb. And I think we just crushed some dudes. Oh, it was that guy. Oh, Boron and Boron. Okay, did we, maybe we set fire to him and then we killed him. That or they're both called Boron and their mother was just really you know, not very creative, and she just called everyone Boron. This one I found is called Brain Control or Mind Control or something like that. All of these, all these creations, I'll leave a link in the description on where you can get them. Most of them are from the Besiege Creations website, but I think the Magnum Opus one is actually from the Steam Workshop. But this one allows you to attach to any kind of NPC, so like, you know, like here, it's got a fucking chicken, um, but you can also attach onto like, you know, any of the dudes, any of the little, you know, soldiers and stuff, or like a cow or a sheep or whatever you can find, and you can control them. So watch this. Watch this. This is really cool. I liked this. Because you can basically just... Look at this! We're controlling a chicken! Isn't that awesome? Oh, fuck. Alright. Oh, these guys want to fight. Why do they want to fight? We're a freaking chicken. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Talk about a murderous chicken. Are these ju bouncy pads? Yes! Okay, now we're upside down. Where'd that chicken go? Where'd the chicken go? I didn't even see where it went. Okay, that's fine. Let's start again. Maybe let's move this to somewhere. Oh, fuck. Maybe we can stick it onto one of these soldiers. Let's give that a try. I reckon this guy just on the side here. Oh, yes, that's it. Just going to drop that down. 
onto your head. Just like that, buddy. There we go. Oh, nice! Yes, can we zoom in on this guy? Hey, hey guys. Nothing out of the ordinary here. I'm just, I'm just your regular pal, Frank. It's fine. It's fine. How you going? How's, how's Mary the, and the kids? They okay? You want to go get a beer or something? I don't think these guys believe that I'm not one of them. It could be because I have a giant fucking thing strapped to my head. But that's alright. Oh, there we go. Oh, shit. Okay. It seems to, um, flop over. I don't know why it's doing this, but it's controlling it in a really weird way. Oh, shit. Now we're just going in circles and stuff. Oh, fuck. I didn't really want to harm any sheep in this video, but I just did. So this one that I got is a bit fucking weird looking. It requires you to have 0G enabled, so let's just go ahead and turn that on. 0G. I read that in the instructions. Um, I don't really know how to control it, apart from that. But we might actually, we might just move it to a better location. Uh, cause here's a pretty, pretty, uh, pretty crappy location. Here looks pretty good. Now hopefully I can remember all the controls, because, um, there were, there were quite a few of them from memory. Yeah, just a couple. <laughs> let's, um, let's hit play. We're probably gonna have to turn the, uh, the speed down a little bit. Just because some of these... You know, they, they slow down and chug up the game unless you slow the, uh, the speed down. Alright, let's, let's hit, uh, start. Oh, couple of, couple of frame jitteries going on there. We should be able to move this thing around. Oh, here we go. Alright, so I think there's a button to detach something. Uh, haven't quite worked that out yet, though. How do we go forward? Oh, this is pretty cool. Alright, and can we move to the sides as well? Alright, that's how we go backwards and forwards. Oh no, we're starting to flip. We don't want to flip. We don't want to flip. We are now kind of on a crazy fucking angle, but that's fine. Um, what else we got? Oh, okay, this is... There's a button to make them transform, because it needs to transform, because there's something on the inside that actually separates. So, we're going to try and do that. So here we go. Here we go. Alright, oh, that's how you move it forward. Okay, we don't want to move it forward anymore. I love the freaking water jets in this thing. Oh, that's it. That's it. Yep, just keep firing that thing away like that. And that should have opened it up. And now, we just need to get this thing out. Okay, let's go. Do we do this? I think we do this. Oh, that's it. Okay. So it's become like a, a nice, neat little, uh, neat little package. And we should be able to accelerate out of its cocoon-like casing. There we go. Oh, holy fuck, this is some crazy space shit going on here. This is awesome! How cool is that? Alright, we need to need to lock the camera onto that so we can see- Oh, holy shit, alright. Because we've got zero G, all the little, uh, soldiers have just floated up into the sky. I love when that happens. Now, there are some mods and things like that that, uh, you know, allow you to change the, uh, the force at which the, the water comes out, like how much water comes out. And I think that actually increases the- I guess the acceleration of, uh, of contraptions like this. So maybe we'll, uh, you know, we'll get into some mods and things like that in some future videos. At the moment though, I'm just loving this. This is fucking awesome. Maybe we can shoot one of these guys out of the sky. That'd be cool. Hey there dudes, how you doing? Just floating around. Alright, we're gonna try and shoot something. So let's, let's see if we can line up these houses perhaps. Cause we've got cannons and stuff, so we might as well make good use of them. This is really hard to control though. I'm not gonna lie. It's very fucking difficult. Alright, here we go, here we go. I'm pretty sure... Oh, is that a cannon? Oh, we didn't even get close. Not even close. Alright, let's just spin it around a little bit. Just a tiny fucking smidgy ditch. There we go. Yes, yes! No! Because we got zero G on, the, you know, the cannonballs aren't really behaving the way that you think that they would. This one is so hard to control. I think it might be a little bit easier to control if I actually install that water mod. So I might give that one a go. We might look at it in like a future video or something and see how we do. I mean, it's a really freaking cool looking creation though. Like, what an awesome looking machine. I love it. But yeah, really, really hard to control. You, it takes a while to sort of steer it around because it moves so slow. But that's cool. There's one more I want to have a look at, and this thing's a freaking fire truck. I don't know if it, uh, if the water actually puts out fires and stuff. I've never, I've never actually tested that. But there's a few bombs and things like that around here, so maybe we'll give that a go. Alright, are you guys prepared to get wet? Here we go. We're coming over. I'm gonna try and spray you with my hose. Oh, don't run away, don't run away! Where are you going? What the hell? That guy just smashed through his own fucking house! Why would he do that? 
Oh, okay, no worries. What's- oh, I don't even know what that thing does. That's alright. That's fine! Because we're just gonna saturate your house for you! I have no idea why, but we're gonna do it. We're gonna just blow up all the shit! Oh, okay. Yep. Oh, God. Yeah, I forgot when you have invincibility on, if you extend parts too far, the whole thing just freaks out and just starts to fucking, you know, <laughs> implode on itself. It's a bit weird, but it's fucking funny as. Oh, old mate just knocked down his own house. Why would you do that, champ? You're a fucking idiot. Okay, well, I'm just gonna leave this fire truck here just to explode on its own. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. We'll clean up the mess later. It's okay. So we'll get into some more mods and stuff like that next time because they look like they're a bunch of fun. But I'll leave this video here for now. I hope you guys liked this one. If you did, give us one of these ones and I'll see you guys next time. Shit! Oh, <laughs> oh my nose. <laughs> Oh, oh, no. oh no! 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 Oh no!